Hey everyone, it's Heath back from Home Zone Wheels and we are out here at Minton Home Center in Oxford, Alabama with another amazing home tour. Again with another one under $100,000. But guys, you're gonna be blown away when you get inside to see how nice these homes really are. Be sure to click follow if you're on Facebook watching us. If you're on YouTube, hit subscribe and hit that bell icon. That way you get notified every time we release another home tour. And if you'll notice guys, this one has that really cool electronic doorbell that has the camera on it. That way, you know exactly who's at your door from your smartphone. Check this front door out. Let's go in and take a look and see what's in here. You guys are really gonna be surprised at what you get for this little bit of money. And it's got kind of that open floor plan whereas the living room and the kitchen are interconnected, but then it breaks it up. It, they do some things here with some of these homes at Minton that I think you're gonna really like, even if you don't necessarily like an open floor plan. I know some of you guys do, some of you don't, but it's kind of got the best of both worlds. So it's not like you're in kind of a box. I know some of you guys that don't like the open floor plans say that, but this one's a little different. So I think you're gonna like it. Just little offsets like this kind of break the rooms up a little bit. So, we're gonna go into, this would be where you'd have your dining room table area. And you got your sliding glass door. And then we're gonna take a look at the island. Place you could have, kind of have your little bar set up a little bit. Enough for two or three bar stools right there. You could slide them underneath. You got your stainless steel Frigidaire, plenty of counter space. And your lights overhead there. Then you've got your dishwasher right next to your sink, as it should be. You've got a big old window there, and that window doesn't open. I don't know if that would be customizable or not for you people that do like the windows that open. You could ask them that. And then here are the shelves over your microwave and your stove. I really like that white look too. Very clean looking. And now let's go into this other room. I think this is like a pantry, maybe laundry. It's got that screen. That's actually screen there. I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera. So let's see air flow through. Kind of that barn style door almost. And then we go in here. It's like a little butler pantry almost. Except it doesn't have a sink, but plenty of space for your canned goods. Man, that's a lot of space too on those shelves. And then as if that wasn't enough, oh, could there be a sink in here? I don't know. I don't know if there is or not. It's a little dark. We're gonna shine the light in here for you guys. There's the place for your washer and dryer. Now I don't see a sink in here. I was hoping it would, but it doesn't have a sink. But for the price, you can't argue with that. Good place for your washer and dryer, but something there is in here, and that is a place for at least a mid-size uh, freezer. So you could get your freezer right there and there's a plug for it. So right off of the kitchen and the pantry area, you've got access to all of that. So let's go back out and take a look at the rest of the house real quick. Let's see. We're just gonna go back and take a look at the guest rooms. So we're gonna go through the kitchen here and take a look real quick at them. And the heating and air is in the floor here, guys. You got the decent uh, looking uh, light fixtures there, like those that are not cheap looking, like some of the stuff you see. These are really nice. I like those, see them dress that up a little bit and how they do like the crown molding over over top. And of course, feel that that is, feels like drywall. And in here, we're having to shine a light for you, but you don't have the wire rack, so that's cool. All right, so let's go and take a look at the other guest room real quick and the guest bathroom. Of course, you've got your standard uh, tub shower combo there. And got your sink. 
Now let's take a look and go inside this other bedroom. And it's getting a little bit late in the day, guys, so I'm losing a little bit of light. So I'm trying to get you guys through here pretty quick. But you got another walk-in closet here. And again, they have upgraded to the nicer shelving. That's really nice. So let's go take a look at the master really quick. We're gonna make this quick and then we'll get back to you guys on how much this is. I told you it's under $100,000 and it is. So let's go take a look and see the master bedroom. You see how it's kind of broke up a little bit here? I like that. And here is the master bedroom. And then we're gonna go take a look at the master closet. And of course that master closet turns all the way back that way and it has the nicer shelving as well. And it also has a light inside there. So now let's go and look at the master bath. Right, ladies, I know you guys like that. You, your freestanding garden tub there. Got your shower on the left and your sinks and mirrors on the right. You've got a window between them. Those good spring days when you want to let a little air in, you could do it right there. You got your toilet right here to the left and that big tub right in front of that window. Now, some of you don't like that. You could put your blinds or curtains up there. Some of you may live out in the middle of the woods or the country and you could look out and see. So you could just imagine what's in there. So now let's go and see how much this thing is. And we will get you the price and get you on to the next home tour. All right, guys, so the Amy is between $96,900, that like the model that's shown right here. This is the, the lot model, and it goes all the way up to $100,900. And again, this is at the time of filming. Could change depending on uh, when you come and, and that sort of thing and your options that you want. Uh, you'll have to talk to the people there at Minton about financing if you're interested in financing. Uh, and if you have any other questions, be sure to give them a call. They're really helpful and they'll be glad to help you with any questions you might have. And we are headed right over there to the next home tour. Come and go with us. All you got to do is click on that box in the upper right hand window and go check out our next home tour. We'll see you guys over there.